<laughs> yeah, so the follow-up question, does everybody have a gift to bring to the world? Maybe some of us don't, or maybe some of us have important gifts and some of us don't really have much of a gift. Einstein maybe had an important gift, but what if you're not that gifted? What if you're not that smart? So I would say, again, that we do not know how this world works. We do not know what choices, what actions on a 500 year time scale are gonna have a big effect. You could be a magnificent inventor, a magnificent thinker, but it could be that your inventions are things whose time has come. And if you weren't gonna invent them, somebody else would invent them. And from that perspective, are you really doing anything that special? Whereas another person could be doing something completely invisible, uh, a stay-at-home mom, maybe um, taking care of, of children with disabilities or somebody working in a kindergarten for disabled children or something like that. Um, and maybe this woman is highly educated, but her gifts are going to very mundane things, you know, changing diapers and, and holding someone's hand and hugging them when they, when they scrape their knee and, and things like that. And it doesn't seem that they're doing any kind of magnificent giving of a gift. But on a 500 year time scale, who knows what the effect of that gift will be. In a way, that's even a bigger gift because she's not getting recognition for it or very much money for it. Uh, she's not being celebrated for it. So her gift is not only of her time, it's also of her ego. It's saying, yeah, I'm not gonna be an important person or a wealthy person in this lifetime because what's calling to me is so immediate and I, I, I have to do this thing. And so, so it's a trust. Ultimately, it comes down to this question, this almost like a forlorn question of, well, maybe I don't have an important gift. The resolution to that comes by stepping into trust in a coordinating intelligence that deploys each one of us exactly where we're needed as part of an inconceivably complex evolution. And maybe only looking back 500 years from now, could you say, yeah, I was in exactly the right place. I was put exactly where I was needed. And my heart called me to do exactly what had to be done in that moment. Short answer is everybody has a gift that is important. It just may not look important from the lens that we've inherited from a culture that celebrates scale and celebrates bigness. 